Hi Fire Signs, Aries, Leo and Sagittarius, Ascendant, Sun, Moon, Venus and Rising and those of you cross watching, welcome to your Tarot Love Messages. Today we're going to take a look at and see who's coming into your life next. Okay, so what will your major, what will your next major relationship be like? Not your next fling here, but you know, the person who is um, going to come into your life next and want to establish a special connection and bond with you. And we'll see when is this person coming in, what will the future of this connection be like or just any other messages that we get around this person and this um, connection. There is going to be a part two to this reading as well and that's going to be made available via the extension link and that will be provided to you via the link below. So just where the show more section is. For those of you that are interested in a personalized tarot reading with myself, please feel free to reach out and inquire. I'm going to list my email address. Um, just where the show more section is as well. Okay guys, so let's go ahead and see who, you know, who is coming into your life next. What will they be like? What will the connection be like here? gonna say you have some beautiful cards here and then the knight of swords showed up not that he's not beautiful but um it's just i feel like you've got someone very special here coming in for you you've got a lot of fire energy so this could be a fire sign in aries leo sagittarius here this could also denote that there's going to be a lot of passion a very strong sense of attraction and infatuation with one another seven of pentacles at the bottom of your deck here tells us that this is someone whom you've been waiting for a long time so this is the type of a connection that you've always wanted you've always longed for this is the type of i feel like you've been waiting for this person and this specific person this very energy who has those traits and character uh sorry characteristics and qualities that you admire here someone whom i feel like this is a type of love the type of bond the type of a connection the type of energy that you've been waiting for a very very long time and let me tell you here guys it's definitely worth the wait now this person that's coming in for you here it feels like they are ready for the next phase the next journey on um of their life here especially when it comes to relationships yeah and it feels like they're in alignment with you so they're very ready okay they're ready for the things that you're ready for it feels like there's a lot of progression in this person's energy so they perhaps are ready to move things to the next level they're looking for someone that they can establish a very strong bond and a commitment with they're waiting it's like they're wanting to settle down okay it's an energy of they're finally uh, feeling very settled in life so maybe in their younger days here in their youth they've done a lot of you know playing the field playing around or just sort of getting out there and meeting new people they might have been a bit restless they may have done a lot of traveling here as well but it feels like they're finally ready to settle here they're finally ready to create a family which i feel like they've always wanted um but it feels like maybe they you know weren't ready earlier on but i feel like they're ready for it now they're finally ready to maybe buy a home here um or perhaps uh you know perhaps just settle down move in with someone here create you know share their personal space here with someone share their world with someone here their life build a life build a future here i feel like this person is ready for um the next phase i feel like they've been through a lot of things and i feel like this is someone who i see has a lot of maturity wisdom and experience behind in their energy here now strong sense of home it's just this notion of home it could the cards could possibly be hinting at the fact that this person feels like home okay 
um, you will build a home with them. You will build a life together. You might even build, potentially build your dream house that you've always wanted. They may build that for you. The two of you may create that together here. Um, it could also be a returning energy here. Someone from the past may be coming home back to you here, but they're stepping in this brand new energy. It's a renewed sense of energy. It's like they've elevated here. They've done some cosmic leveling up, and now they're ready for all the things that you're ready for here. Could be a childhood sweetheart as well with the Six of Cups. And this is could be like, yes, it could be someone from the past. It could be a former flame. It could be someone from um, someone that you are romantically, perhaps even maybe even loosely involved with. Uh, but it feels like for some of you, it is someone from the past making a return, making their way home back to you. It's also this feeling of this person feels like home. This person feeling so familiar. You feeling so comfortable and at ease with one another. It could also, I feel like there's just something about this connection that feels like they are your soulmate here. Okay, and maybe that's why they're returning home back to you. Maybe the two of you have known each other in a previous lifetime here. The two of you have, you know, are binded to one another via soul contract here and you've both negotiated the terms in which you'll meet each other you know in, in the next lifetime being this lifetime here and maybe that's the energy of coming home that I'm getting for some of you yes I do feel like it's a past energy and I see a reunion with this person I also see a possible marriage and engagement children in the cards for you maybe this is someone who's had children from a previous marriage maybe the two of you will go on to have children um, boy and a girl is coming up here for you maybe even a set of twins in fact something about this feels very much like destiny is at play here okay it's like if this is an energy from the past, it's like you guys, after years, you guys will, after quite some time, a lengthy amount of time, you guys will reunite and come back together, reconnect. Okay, the universe here, destiny here, will orchestrate that fateful encounter here. Okay. In which your souls can once again meet one another, your paths can once again cross with one another. If this is someone whom you've had, like if you've had a, if you shared a special connection with this person in the past, but for whatever reason it didn't work out due, the, due to the complexities and the intricacies of that um, connection here, then I feel like this time things will be a little bit different here. It just feels like since then the both of you have done some growing and some evolving, some cosmic leveling up here. It just feels like the both of you are more ready. Okay, maybe you were, you know, younger. Back in the day, the two of you were a lot younger, a little less wiser, not as, you know, mature, not as ready to settle, not as ready to um, commit here. It just feels like things are different this time. It also feels like this is destined for you. And what's destined for you cannot miss you. It will seek you out and you will seek it out. And the two of you do feel like soulmates. You do feel like the two of you were destined to, you know, cross paths with one another. Or you were destined to reconnect and um, reignite with one another here. This is someone who's very successful I'm picking up. I feel like this is someone who's gone on to have a very sex, a successful career path, especially. I feel like this person is very well accomplished. I'm seeing a lot of praises and accolades, a lot of awards and recognitions for what they've done here. They could also be like, um, I'm getting like a famous, uh, famous filmmaker maybe, or a musician. I just feel like there's someone that a lot of people look up to and praise for their talents and you know their hard work here. Um, they've got a very, they've got a lot of um, admirable traits, and, and it feels like this person has leadership qualities here. I'm not getting egoism with this person. I just feel like it's a sense of confidence with the Six of Wands, and I feel like this person has moved their life in a very positive direction, in a very positive way here. quite athletic from what I can see. I feel like this person is someone who takes good pride of themselves. They take good care of themselves. Good pride in themselves, that is. Um, they are someone who I, I see them working out a lot or I see them being very, like they could be a health or a fitness fanatic. Um, someone who's just, you know, a little bit strict. But I think I like to call it, you know, having standards, having high standards and adhering to those standards. So um, that's how I see it. There could also be an athlete, ath uh, sorry, an athlete as well, because I'm getting a lot of athleticism, like an 
athletic body or just very athletic. Maybe they played sports when they were younger. Maybe they still play sports, perhaps even on a professional level for some. Um, the two of you still have so much to give to one another. You still have so much love to explore here with one another. And it just feels like a beautiful connection. I feel like this could be all you've ever wanted. And I do feel like this is something that you've been waiting for here. Okay? I feel like you've... You, you know, you haven't had a lot of luck here. You've been hurt and you haven't had a lot of luck when it comes to um, romance and relationships. And I feel like perhaps you had to, you know, you had to kind of go through the wrong ones to get to this, the right one. So that's it for your messages, guys. We are going to explore more messages in a little bit more detail in part two of the reading as to when this person might be coming back, when it all might be coming into your life here. Um, what else you need to know about this connection here? And how might this fateful encounter take place here? Okay, just a little bit more detail about what will the future hold for the two of you. So follow me via the extension link below. Once again, for those of you interested in a reading, feel free to connect. Otherwise, thank you guys for your time, your energy and attention. It is greatly appreciated. Thanks guys again. Bye for now.